Yes. The birthday boy is the man in the wine. I'm not good at colors, but I, I believe it's wine. <laughs> Kweko is now my legal son. He has been my son now for over one year. But today, it has been legalized that he is now my son in whom I'm well pleased. I am very, very happy to have him as my child. We are not only here to live on the motherland. We are not only here to show the skills. We are not only here to tell uh, what has been going down there and what we are about to learn. We are about to integrate. We are here to integrate with the local people. Thank you very much for checking me out. This is Echo Simpson. I'm glad that you clicked on this video. Kindly like, comment, share, and then push this video. I'm very happy today, a little bit emotional because uh, this is the time for a brother who is uh, an African and then for an auntie who is also an African to come together to be one family. Uh, I had an invitation to come to Moy's apartment. I didn't know what was going on, but to my uh, amazement, uh, a brother has been adopted by Moy. You already know Moy, right? When I started interview Moy, everybody was talking about Moy, Moy, Moy. She's a free-spirited type. She's an open-minded person. She always want to be part of the local people. I mean, part of everybody. And today, we are here in her apartment to celebrate the adoption of her son. Yes. Uh, Moy spoke to me and said, Echo, I've been in Ghana for a while. I met this younger brother. Uh, he's been so honest with me. He's been so loyal to me. Anytime I need him, he's there to support. And I'm always there to support him as well. So I thought that I should take things legally. So they went to court. They did their signing. And then she's finally adopted the brother. So let's go inside and experience the celebration of the adoption of this brother by Miss Moy. Let's go. Yes, so as you can see, uh, a lot of things are happening here. There's a beautiful family here, Mr. Williamson, a whole crew right here in Atebu Pan African village in the house of Miss Moy. And it's so nice. Good mention of why we are here to celebrate the beautiful celebration of Moy adopting his son. So we're going to talk to Moy a little bit and then talk to the brother and then the other audience who are here to share their opinion on this beautiful occasion happening in Asseb. To come in, which is the main purpose we are all here. So please, Mr. Rafael Ansa Hoyan. Yeah. Everybody knows the purpose of this garden. I think the purpose of this garden is two. One, to celebrate the new birthday of Mr. Raphael Ansa Hoyon. And the most important thing, too, is celebration of adoption that is now from the high court judiciary of ghana has legally rightfully approved the adoption of rafael ansa which is formerly rafael ansa is now part of the hoyan family so now his last name has been added as uh, Raphael Ansa Hoyan. So now he's part of the Hoyan family, which is being adopted by <laughs> Moy Hoyan. So now he's a legal son of Moy Hoyan. So 
Kweko is now my legal son. He has been my son now for over one year. But today, it has been legalized that he is now my son in whom I'm well pleased. I am very, very happy to have him as my child. And I have with me with the legal document. You have me by her side since she came in from America. I've been with her, helping her around and everything. And then she told me she wants to adopt me as his, her son. And I said, okay, because from me being with her, I've seen the kind of goodness and the, the, the kind heart she has. So I wanted to make sure that I don't disappoint her in any form. And I always want to be there for her whenever she needs me. And I pray that God give me that strength to make sure that I fulfill whatever she wants me to do for her. And I thank her very much for the opportunity she has given me. And I hope and that everything will be okay between me and my mom. I don't want him to say, what is his official name right now? So, Raphael uh -huh. and sir uh -huh. Oyen. Oyen. Yes. Okay. He is he has my name. Okay. That name he will die with. That's my name. His wife will get that name. Ah. His children will get that name. <laughs> and my grandchildren will get yeah. that name. And I'll be proud. He's really a good human being. Mm. I swear. There's good and bad everywhere. Yeah. But I'm blessed. Yeah. I believe that I have more good in Ghana than bad. So I'm always selling the good because that's more important than anything else. The good. See, bad news sells, yeah. but I sell good news. <laughs> yeah, me knowing you for a while now, you're always on the positive side of it. You have to stay positive. Yeah, you. you know, yeah, you can't use a neck because where are you going to go? You're going to go anywhere? Yeah. Okay, yeah. but if you do the right thing and you sell the positive, it will move to better, yeah. and we need better. better. That's what we need. We need better, good, better, best. best. One right. day we're gonna get there. Yes, and that's what I'm striving for. Great, great, good, better, best. I know my brother is in his better or the best because he's been living a good life, and now Miss Moore has added a bit to. His life right now, Mr. Raphael. Charlie, congrats. Yes. Yeah, so my my question is, how was the feeling like when Miss Moy said, "Hey, I need to legally have you as my own." How was the feeling like for you? It was like unbelievable feeling, but I didn't dream about that. Yeah. I was just doing that for her, making that she wanted to do for her, for me. But I didn't even think about that. Yeah. yeah. So when it came up that she wanted to adopt me, I was very excited. I told him yes because that's the opportunity that yeah. you know, I lost my mom and dad. So it's oh. like, yeah, I've yeah. been on my on myself. So yeah. if I if I'm getting a mother figure in my life, mm -hmm. I don't have to take the opportunity. Right. Yeah. So yeah, I accept it. Wow, wow. Yeah, that is that is a little bit emotional right there because like he's lost his mom, his dad, and I, I I lost my mom when I was one year old. Oh my god! So I don't even know I'm who my mother is. Right? Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. But for him to get a replacement at this age, yeah, it's like it's like a whole a new world. Yeah, new, new world. A whole new world. Yeah. yeah. So I believe that he's done his best to nature. Because mm -hmm. like me, I believe in nature. Mm -hmm. I'm not a Christian, I'm not a Muslim. Mm -hmm. I believe love and understanding exactly. is a religion. It's a good so thing. If he didn't love you, he wouldn't be honest with you, mm -mm. trustworthy, and all that. So I appreciate him exhibiting that attitude or character. And then you seeing that, saying that, no, this is the kind of person that I want. Yes. So now, what is the way forward for? I, I would say for your new family, because I've been part of my family for like, <laughs> I don't know, since I was born. Yeah. <laughs> what is the new thing for this big family? Right well, now? 
it's just official. Okay. But the thing is that I chose him mm -hmm. because I know mm -hmm. that he's going to be uh, there yeah. for me. Yeah. We went out to take care of some business. Mm -hmm. And he doesn't realize how much it meant to me. He held my hand. And in my mind, I imagine being old and he's there to yeah. hold my hand. And that meant a lot to yeah. me. He held my hand so I wouldn't fall. Mm -hmm. He protects me. The restaurant, I couldn't have done it without him. He's the one who's running the restaurant. That's his restaurant. That's his <laughs> business. Yes, that's his business. Mm -hmm. And when you can leave somebody 100%, go anywhere, do anything, and know it's fine, yeah. he's, he has my back. Yeah. Because I told him, I said, he has to do, he has he doesn't have to do anything yeah. because it already is. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. So, if whomever is there for you, mm -hmm. that's the person that should gain anything from you. Yeah. I'm hearing, I have other children, mm -hmm. but I'm here in Ghana by myself. Yeah. And God has been good and blessed me with good people. Mm -hmm. I mean, you're going to have negative, but the negative, you know me. I don't buy, sell, yeah. or trade the negative. negative. <laughs> I leave that alone, okay? Yeah. But the positive is, I know for sure, if I never get married, my son will be there for me. Yeah. I have two. Kwesi is young, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so he's coming next. Yeah. So I'll have two sons. Yeah. You know, he'll help his brother to yeah. be okay. Yeah. Right, honey? Yeah. So... I'm blessed. Yeah. I know I have one of the best sons right now yeah, in the world. In the world. <laughs> I couldn't ask God for anything Great. better. Great. So, hey, um, it just was a short one to let you know that positive things are happening yes. all around Africa. You may want to have, a, you may be skeptic about a lot of things, but we are here to show you how uh, positive things are going on here. Miss Moy is already a uh, Partially, like 99% done the pair apartment upstairs. Oh. And I will definitely show you a little videos with uh, her apartment upstairs. So thank you very much for checking us out. It's a beautiful day. We're celebrating. We are eating. We are drinking, getting drunk, getting a blue pet. <laughs> and then tomorrow we will come your way with another video. So Charlie, congrats to you. Mm -hmm. And then congrats to you. Yes, no, we are now a big family. Amen.